All right, guys, um, just a quick thing that I wanted to share. Um, a lot of friends have been asking me, and basically, it seems that a lot of people don't know this. So I'm sure you've found before these kind of double zips on, a, on an item of clothing. Let me just find one here. So quite often they're the outside pocket on the side. As you can see, this one doesn't. But on this jacket, you can see it's the inside. So basically, you've got this double zip. One on, it looks like it's on the inside of the pocket. This jacket it actually says packable in pocket. A lot of jackets don't have that. So basically what this double zip means is that the zip, which you can't close from the inside, is there so that when you turn it inside out, so this jacket basically, you can just squash it into, you could roll it if you wanted to, but you just squash it into that pocket and it will fit. And I know this is a down jacket, but you get this with synthetic jackets, down jackets, Basically anything that's got this double zip, I'm just going to squash it all in. So I've squashed it all in. And as you can see, I should be able to just about close it now. I'll squash a bit more on the top, but it does work. And once... Oh, sorry. There you are. So... And the reason they've designed this is because it's kind of easy to take that with you on trips. It's got this kind of loop so you can put a carabine on it. If your bag is full and you want to take the jacket off, you could clip it to the side of your back and know it's safe. So yeah, basically the way to know if you can pack your, your item into its own pocket is if it's got this double zip. And to undo it, you just open the zip and just pull everything out. And when you've pulled it all out, you realize that the pocket just goes back to normal and then the normal zip is on the outside that you'd use to close that pocket so yeah if your item has got this double zip sorry double zipper then it's there to be folded into its own pocket and what people don't realize is people always think this is to do with jackets or jumpers or fleeces but actually as you can see here it could be a jacket could be anything but actually same same idea you know it's packed away you open it up but this is actually, oh, again, you just pull it out. It's actually a small backpack. So you can see, just untangle it. It's a small backpack. It's got this kind of back protector on it, which it's foldable and, and rollable. And then on this item, there's actually the lid pocket. There you go, so if I close that, then you would, you'd never think, you'd never know that you could fold it into its own pocket. But, as I explained just a few minutes ago, if you look at the zip, you've got the double zipper again. So that is a clear indication that the item can be folded into its own pocket. Um, and usually that means that that pocket is big enough forward for the item so go often these pockets are slightly larger so on, on, on jackets and stuff you find that the the chest pocket as you could see it, it actually goes all the way down there so it is that big not because they maybe wanted it to be that big but they needed to be this big to fit the jacket inside it so there you are so if you have a jacket or a bag or an item where you've got this double zipper then you should try and fold it and it's easy quite often for instance for this backpack I mean it's called the Compressor Plus, it's a very small backpack but it is ideal for travelling because you can fit this into its own pocket and then just squash it into your big backpack when you're going hiking and then you can take it as a day pack when you arrive. So yeah, hopefully that was helpful and uh, if you've always wondered or you've got one of these double zippers then uh, that is what it's for. I know they say with down you shouldn't compress it too much and um, because it can break the down but I mean, it depends how much you go, you you would actually use that double zipper compartment. I've got a Prima Love jacket that I've always put in it, and it just sits in my winter bag. It's just an emergency one. But generally speaking, I would try and keep down basically uncompressed like that. You can, I mean, you could just stuff that in your bag. But sometimes if your bag is full, you want to clip it to the outside. That is a good way to do it. Hopefully, it was helpful. And uh, yeah, remember to subscribe, and I will share some more tips as when I can think of them. Um, there's always a few things that people don't know, so it's probably, hopefully, it's useful to someone.
So there you are. If you've got this double zipper, check out if you can pack it. And like I said, sometimes they do, like this jacket, it does say packable pocket, but it doesn't always do that. Thanks for watching and uh, see you next time.